Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. Today, we are on a new adventure. Unknowingly, an epic one at that. 56 hour tuna excursion aboard the Scat Cat. Scat Cat is an amazing vessel in itself. 72 foot aluminum catamaran, built in the 70s. It's recently been updated to run two Cat D18 industrial engines. Contains state of the art electronics. And yeah, I may have snuck into the helm to see for myself. Our destination is Shell Perdido. Translate to the Lost. Floating rig 180 miles from our port. It was a full stay run to get there and rightfully named. It wasn't long and the tuna began to explode at the surface. We started off jigging deep water jigs. This was my first tuna trip and had no idea what to expect. We started catching black fin on the jigs. Some of the smaller ones we used as bait. quickly the key to free lining chunk bait for yellowfin. Bury the hook and have absolutely no line tension. I sped up the 20 minutes of working around the boat. <laughs> Using a jigging reel with only 50 pounds of drag added to the fun. bigger fish in the gill plate to reduce the chance of them dragging these powerful fish onto the boat. It's, it's too easy for y'all now. Uh, fish pulled the reel. 
Continue to catch blackfin and yellowfin all throughout the night. There is even a tilefish and a couple of sharks. Seems like the larger yellowfin were all caught on topwater lures. Something I'll definitely be prepared for on the next trip I go on. The next morning, by about 10 o'clock, we were limited out on yellow and had plenty of blackfin on board. At this point, they decided to go on and hit some, some vermilion snapper, some more tilefish, and maybe some grouper. It was kind of an exploratory trip, something they don't normally have time to do. On our way to a Vermilion Snapper fishing spot, we ran across a pot of whales. We ended up catching snapper all the way into the evening. Unfortunately, reds protected this time of year in federal water, so they all had to be released. We were targeting the bee liners of vermilion snapper. The process got good experience on how to tell the difference between when they hit the lines. Snapper have hard, forceful hits, and the bee liners of vermilion will have several soft hits. The next morning is quite foggy and is getting towards the end of the trip. We still had a little more fun trolling, caught a few jacks, quite a bit of excitement.
Then it was time to head home, and trust me, we were ready. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and go find an adventure. Whether it's on the Scat Cat out of Port Aransas, Texas, or in your own backyard.